this is my gaming laptop. I got it for around $1,500 over a year ago. And in today's video, my goal is to double how much FPS this laptop gets compared to stock. In order to achieve these results, we'll be using our tweaks, which by the way, work on both laptops and desktop PCs. And aside from boosting your FPS, they also decrease your input delay and ping. So the first thing that I'm going to do is find out how much FPS the laptop gets stock. So I reinstalled Windows and after reinstalling Windows, I downloaded a few things like my recording software, Fortnite and Rero Statistics Tuner to measure my FPS. So this laptop is getting about 350 to 400 FPS in a blank creative map while looking at the sky. The average is about 370 to 380. And I think that's pretty decent, but I'm sure we can double this by the end of the video. I'll first show three basic optimizations and my free utility. And later in the video, I'll get to much more advanced stuff. So let's get into the tweaks. Alrighty, so the first thing that we're going to be doing is downloading the files used in the video. So for that, you just want to go to the description of any of my videos. And in here, simply find a Discord link and it will take you to my discord server so once you're in here simply head over to the free tweaks category also for you it should only show one channel i just have this one for the sake of the video the first thing that we have is going to be downloading our game user settings so just press this this will take you to my google drive and simply right click and download the zip file it should show up in the top corner right here so i'm just gonna press on it and all i have to do is just drag it onto my desktop like this boom and the way you apply it is just press windows and r and type in percent local app data percent and it will open this little folder in here simply find fortnite game press on it then we have saved config windows client and in here you can find game user settings and all you have to do is just drag the game user settings file in this folder and replace the old one so boom also a little side note for the boys who use stretch res you can of course go into the game user settings and edit it again all right so that's everything for game user settings the next Fortnite related optimization that we're going to be doing is opening the Epic Games Launcher. You're going to want to go into Options and in here uncheck High Resolution Textures and make sure pre-downloaded streaming assets are uh, checked. And I know 99% of you guys already know this, but just double check because I still see people having uh, high resolution textures downloaded. So, you know, it's always better to check. All right. So what we have next is going to be hardware acceleration. So I'm going to go into graphic settings in here going to change default graphics settings and in here we have hardware accelerated gpu scheduling and this is a really interesting setting because on certain pcs it's better to be disabled while on others it actually helps when it's enabled that's why i highly recommend testing it out personally i'm going to disable it because i did some tests on this exact same pc six months ago and i found out that my fps is more stable when it's disabled all right so the next thing that we're going to be using is our free tweaking utility to optimize your pc for that all you have to do is just head over to our discord again and go to the free tweaking utility channel it takes about 10 minutes to apply and i highly recommend watching the tutorial but please do it after you finish watching this video now it's time for the results after using these four different things again i'll just load into a blank creative map and while looking at the sky i'm getting about 400 to 450 fps see my fps increased by 50 which that's pretty good anyways after this, I had a bunch of things planned like enabling Orbar for NVIDIA GPUs, a GPU overclock guide, and so much more. But after applying all of those tweaks on the laptop, they didn't really increase the FPS. I mean, they definitely made it a lot more stable and my latency decreased a lot. I'll definitely add those into a different video. But, you know, the main goal of this video was doubling my FPS. So I kind of just decided to pull the ace out of my sleeve, which is going to be using our premium tweaking utility. And if you're wondering what that is, it's basically one tool designed to completely optimize your PC for the best possible performance and lowest possible latency. We have over 2000 positive reviews from our customers on our Discord server and website. So make sure to check out exmtweaks.com to completely optimize your PC and unlock your full potential. Anyways, let's see the results. All right, y'all, so I just loaded into a blank creative map. And as you can see, I'm getting about 500 to 550 FPS while just looking around. And now I'll show the side-by-side -side comparison between stock, free, and premium. And as you can see, while looking at the sky, premium is getting about 700 FPS. It's not exactly double the FPS that the laptop was getting stuck. It's about a 90% increase, which is still absolutely insane. And I just want to tell you guys, not every PC will have these results. Of course, every PC is different. There's many factors which play into this. Anyways, I'm sorry if this video was kind of short, but I had to scrap a lot of parts, which I'll definitely include in other videos. My next video is going to be about my free tweaking utility. I will be dropping a massive update, so make sure to stay tuned for that. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I love you. See you later.